as honored in today's Google Doodle. The 24th of November is the 41st anniversary of the discovery of Lucy, the name given to a collection of fossilized bones that once made up the skeleton of a hominid from the Australopithecus afarensis species who lived in Ethiopia 3.2 million years ago. First discovered in 1973, the discovery of Lucy was remarkably complete, 40% of her skeleton was found intact, rather than just a handful of incomplete and damaged fossils that usually make up remains of a similar age. Shortly after being dug up, it became apparent that Lucy was one of the most important fossils ever discovered, when researchers released that she belonged to a previously unknown species. In honor of the momentous moment in archaeology, here's five things you may not know about Lucy. Number 1. She was named after the Beatles song, Lucy in the Sky with Diamonds. After making the historic find, paleoanthropologist Donald Johansson headed back to his campsite with his team. He put a Beatles cassette in the tape player, and when Lucy in the Sky with Diamonds came on, one of the group said, he should call the skeleton Lucy. All of a sudden, she became a person, Johansson told the BBC. Number 2. Lucy walked upright. One of the most important things about Lucy is, the way she walked, by studying her bones, in particular the structure of her knee and spine curvature, scientists were able to discover that she spent most of her time walking on two legs, a striking human-like trait. Number 3. No one knows how she died. The few clues we have about Lucy's cause of death can only rule things out, rather than providing solid answers. There's not much evidence of teeth marks anywhere on her skeleton, suggesting she was not killed and scavenged by other animals, after she died. However, there is one tooth mark, from a carnivore on the top of her left pubic bone, but it's not known, whether this happened before she died, or whether she was bitten after. Number 4. Lucy currently lives in Ethiopia, near to where she was found. The skeleton of Lucy currently lies hidden away from the public, in a specially constructed safe in the National Museum of Ethiopia, in Addis Ababa. Not far from where she was discovered, only a plaster replica of her skeleton, is available to be seen by the public. However, the real skeleton was taken on a tour of the US, from 2007 to 2013, despite fears that the tour damaged it. A number of other plaster casts of Lucy's remains are dotted around the world. Number 5. She was pretty short. Australopithecus afarensis may have walked upright and looked somewhat human-like, but they were much smaller than we are. Lucy died as a young, but fully grown adult, and stood only 3.7 feet tall, and weighed in at a paltry 29 kilograms. Thank <laughs> you.